On our sixth day in New Zealand, all welding work on our boat was finally done and we prepared to start our road trip around the bottom of the South Island. While I packed up our fishing gear and diving gear, Joshua made some finishing touches to the boat's electronics and sighted in his rifle. Alright, so it's day six now and we're finally ready to head away. Uh, yeah. We, we spent a day in the bush and figured out uh, all the gear that we were missing, all the gaps in our packs and uh, some things that I had forgotten back in Abu Dhabi, which was very unfortunate. Uh, meanwhile, the boat was being repaired. Uh, we had to get the wheel bearing changed and a bit of welding. I wanted some modifications done um, so we could fit a big chiller in the boat for all the fish we're going to catch. Um, but yeah, car, car and boat is ready. All packed up. Uh, it's about six o'clock, so we're in a bit of a hurry. We've got a couple of hours drive to our first stop up in the Southern Alps. See yous. Road trips around the South Island are awesome because you rarely hit traffic, except maybe a flock of sheep. We arrived at Forest Park campsite after dark, set up camp and enjoyed a bottle of wine under a beautiful night sky with other travellers from all over the world whose faces we never saw. Made our first leg, um, camping in Craigieburn. Craigieburn? Craigieburn Craigie Burn Forest, Forest Park. Park. So it's up in the Craigieburn range uh, between Christchurch and Greymouth or Hokitika. Uh, in the middle of the South Island, in the middle of the Southern Alps. Great for skiing, climbing, hunting, hiking, and we'll see if it's good for paragliding. <laughs> but, good uh, night. See you. Hey everyone, if you liked the video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for watching.